the new name. Good to see y'all. It's Thursday night, and we're here to play some Fightcade. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, as y'all know, for the last couple weeks now, Avi and I have been chilling out, playing some different games. Not just uh, we get, get, I give Gundam a little bit of, of a break. She's still playing it, I think. Um, but uh, for the last couple weeks, we've been going through some other stuff. So last week, we played Umineko Golden Fantasia. Uh, we played some Immaterial and Missing Power, the, that first Toho fighting game. And today we got we, so getting a fightcade working has been kind of a struggle, but uh, thanks in in large part to Kyan's help, uh, I believe we should have Sailor Moon working as well as possibly some other games. We'll see. Uh, hey, what up, Tasty John? Sailor Moon is dope as fuck. Uh, I actually have, well, Irene has her her childhood Super Famicom complete with an excellent condition, maybe not excellent, but a good condition copy of Sailor Moons. I've gotten to play the game on the original hardware and it is pretty godlike. Hey, what up, Ben Reed? What up, Deeps? All the all the poverty heads coming out. I know, okay, I know, hey, DB Blues, Merlin, thank you for the follow. Listen, I know that the Sailor Moon community goes hard as fuck for this game, all right? I rolled up to Frosty Faustings and I wasn't sure what to expect. Um, I was just looking at, you know, I, I messed around with the game a bit. I'll, I'll like, I, I busted out for some like casual play sessions, that kind of stuff. Um, and I know that the Sailor Moon community goes hard as fuck because I walked over to the setup where they had, they had the, the USB converters for SNES to, you know, to like USB sticks and shit. Um, I walk over there and within 30 seconds, the dude running the setup has given me a link to the Discord, added me to it. He's got this laminated placard that shows you all the different colors for all the different characters and all the buttons and all the tech and blah, 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 blah. I'm like, holy shit, y'all are going in. And I respect it. So I figured today I'm going to get AV on the horn and we're just going to play some games of Sailor Moon. We'll see We'll see how long we can stick with Sailor Moon. We might end up trying some other shit on Fight Cape, but you know, as long as we got this shit working, we can try a bunch of stuff. So, without further ado, oh my god, Marvel Heads, I, I need to just leave this lobby as much as it pains me to admit it, Marvel Heads do not d stop spamming the challenge, uh, the, the challenge action whenever they see anyone in there. I respect it, you gotta get those games in. Anyway, we're gonna try and give Avi a call right now. Hello, hello. Hello. Hi. How you doing? Doing all right. Can you hear me okay? <sighs> yes. Yes. You can hear me. Yes. Okay, I can cool. hear you just fine. I'm. I'm. <clears throat> I just muted you on your stream so that I'm not ah. experiencing double pat stereo vision. Excellent. <laughs> yeah. That. that there, there is nothing quite well. Hearing the same thing with roughly maybe what 50 milliseconds to maybe a half a second of lag is disturbing enough. When you hear yourself, like when you're listening to yourself on 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 your own stream or whatever, nope. and it, it is the worst. Anyway, how are you doing? Can't Avery? do it. I'm doing pretty good. Yay! <clears throat> I'm glad to hear it. It has been a hell of a day. We are all game awarded and cyberpunked out. Oh my god! <laughs> shout sure shout to Sephiroth showing up. <laughs> And just just running through the Smash crew. I was gonna say like maybe you should play should have played Final Fantasy VII tonight. Um. <laughs> Yo, we could too bad. I don't think they have. Was it uh, was was it Air Guys? God bless the ring that had a bunch yeah, of Final oh Fantasy God, VII. Yeah, that would have been good. Yeah, and then eventually they they got uh wasn't wasn't there like. Was there actually just a Final Fantasy VII fighting game, or was it just Air Guys that got the characters? It was just Air Guys, but there's a fun tidbit. Okay, I've I I've been thinking about this game since I I played it when I was like a kid, when I was like 13 years old. I played the game Xeno Gears, yeah, which was another edgy JRPG, um, really big, really messy game, super interesting, really cool. It has a 2v2, or a, excuse me, a 1v1 arena fighter mm -hmm. built into the game. So, like, halfway through, when you're, like, 30 hours in, there's, like, this tournament arc that takes place in, like, one of the storylines. Whoa. And then at the end of the game, you can, you can like, unlock it as a thing you can play in, like, the, the JRPG post game where you're just, like, flying around. But it has a 1v1 mode. You can put in another controller and play okay. with it. 
Wait, wasn't wasn't there like didn't Xeno Saga have like a mech battling mode in it too? Yeah, because all the Xeno series like typically has like well, I don't know if the, if if Xeno Saga had like a one v one fighter in it, but mm. they typically have like the thing is is like you you have your like normal right you're like a person doing martial arts and then you get your get your big old robot. Cool. Well, alas, we have no no Sephiroth and Air Guys today. As much as I would love to see whether he was faithfully Sorry, ported yeah. into the Smash, <laughs> into Smash Ultimate or not. Today we got some motherfucking Sailor Moon. I think this is working. Did you get your control set up on your end? Um, I did. I figured out how to do it. Cool. Um, I have no idea what the controls are supposed to be. Mm -hmm. Um because it's an NES game. So I guess I'll just figure it out. Yeah. So, well, actually, uh, yeah, we'll get in there and we'll just map it. I, I think it's uh, Y and X are light punch and heavy punch and B and A are, are light kick and heavy kick. Um, so it's kind of, it's, it's like one of the KOF styles. Anyway, I'm going to sit, I'm, I'm going to send you a challenge real quick. Wow. Okay. My uncle who works at Nintendo says the S in Sailor Moon S stands for Sephiroth. God damn. <laughs> Whoa, dang. That is some grand synergization. <laughs> All right. I've sent you a challenge. We'll see if this works. Also, I had to I had to hook up my stick for this because it, my hitbox wasn't letting me down back, and that's kind of a big deal in a fighting game. Yeah, I'm gonna allow access to yeah. all of the things that Windows oh, is yelling. Oh, levels, levels. I'm sorry about the levels, y'all. Uh, we're gonna turn this way the fuck down. Let me let me know how the audio is in the game. Yeah. Oh, oh god, I want full screen. Yeah, it is impossible to not like hum along. All right, that's probably about as big as we're getting. Oh, did we desync? What? Did you freeze? Oh. Uh, oh, were you I setting your buttons just freeze, now? But... Yeah, I did try to set my buttons. Just okay, now. okay. I think it's probably smart <laughs> and like stops the playback when you're doing that. So yeah, just do that. Okay, great. And what 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 were they again? Okay. Uh, so Y is light punch, X is heavy punch, B is light kick, A is heavy kick. Okay, interesting. Um. All right. Cool. I'm so ready. I, I love that they write tournamento in katakana, but. Opushon is considered enough of a loan word to write it in uh, hiragana. All right. Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> By the way, actually, before we get into playing each other, um, I want to run this story segment real quick. I just want to run the intro. Yeah, yeah. Because this is this has always been funny to me. I love seeing this amount of pixel art. Yep. I love seeing it. <laughs> Ichogari. So they, they just finished, I don't know which story arc this is, but this takes place after they finished uh, beating someone, like beating a villain, right? Yeah, because this has to be, it's Sailor Moon S, right? So it's gotta be. Yeah. And then Sailor Moon says, man, I'm, I, I just, I'm, I'm, I'm the strongest, right? That's what it means to be what is it, the princess, <laughs> I think. And Pluto's like, <laughs> they're, they, you these, came my son. they're they're basically just like nah. <laughs> I think that means I don't know Japanese super well, but I think that means nah. Yeah. <laughs> you think you're nice? <laughs> well, ah! <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what the, what the, how's your Sailor Moon laugh, baby? I'm putting her on the spot. She doesn't want to do it. <laughs> but I love it. These are like perfect, goofy, soggy faces. I always yeah. forget that she is such... 
she's such a funny brat who yep. gets to be just the goofiest cartoon character. <laughs> and so she's trying to play it, play it off now, right? She's like, no, no, I'm just joking. Just you don't, you don't, it doesn't have to be so serious. <laughs> Me and Anna. Alright, Mars Mars rolls up. Oh. <laughs> Mate Masta. Yeah, so basically at this point everyone's like, yo, why don't we have a tournament to see who's the strongest? <laughs> like we should actually do that. Yeah. Of course, as Sailor V, I have to do my best. She's like, you love me this much? <laughs> these drawings are so good. I love all of these Usagi faces. They're yeah. perfect. Especially, just, just imagine seeing this on like a CRT. After after you 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 know you get back from dinner with your mom or whatever. Oh shit, Chibi Moon came there. <laughs> Hell yeah, that's the plot line right here. We gotta see who's strongest. Yeah, it's look, it's just a bunch of gals hanging out trying to see who's the strongest. That's that's what high they're they're in high school at that point, right? Middle school. Middle school. That's that's what a bunch of junior high school girls do, right? All right, I'm, I'm a restart it from here. Yeah, you fight each other to see who's strongest. It's totally normal girls. I mean, not it's like very every normal weekend. for girls. If I had fighting games back then, that's what I would have been doing. Right? I mean, so Irene used to play her sister in this game a lot. Okay, with that, oh, that's cute. Let's give the shot a stop. Let's give this a, a shot. All right. Your controls working? Um. Yes. I think we're desynced though. Tight. Okay, then I'm gonna quit and restart. <laughs> Just because things are happening without me pressing it and it doesn't look like what you're doing. Right. Okay. I am running back the challenge. Oh wow, and now there's there's more people showing up in the lobby. So one of the fun things about this game, and this is, this is I think I've heard, possibly read on Wikipedia. I, I forget if it's actually in the data for this game or not. Um, but I believe this is Arc System Works first fighting game. Yes, I've heard that from Irene. All right. Okay, cool. We got character select. Oh yeah, we did it. Okay, so, this looks like it's working. Have you actually played this game before? Okay, so I haven't even touched this game before. Tight. Okay. I've seen I've seen a tournament. All right. I there's a lot of cheap shit. Uh, let's let's start by just picking some characters, and uh, I, I I think I can probably remember some of the cheap shit. I'll start with Usagi. All right. So Ben Reed says, kind of hey, yes. Many of the devs who worked on this game went on to be founding members of Arxis. That makes sense. Oh, interesting, interesting. All right, so first, uh, we'll start off in Crystal Tokyo. That, I don't think there's a random select on stage. All right. Yo, we got the, we, we got the opening right. pose. Oh, shit. Whoa. <laughs> All right, so the fun thing is this game is not letting me down back either, so I guess I'm not blocking low today. Oh. Yeah, is that... Okay, wait, so I can... Oh yeah, I can't down back either. What is going on? <laughs> I'm gonna I'm I'm check my uh, my inputs real quick. Yeah, as soon as I try and press down and back at the same time. Oh, so you have to set you have to actually set the diagonals. Okay, up left, up right, down right, down left. Okay, <laughs> let's see if this works. Oh, I should I should do that too. Yeah. Oh, uh, and Terry is saying you have to allow left and thing. Okay, got it. So you have to allow the the simultaneous inputs check as well. Okay. 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 Let's see. And where do you where do you find? Oh, left plus right up plus down. Yeah, you okay. see that that you see that that check box in the lower right. Yes, I do. All right. Oh, you and got then down you back. Also have to set the diagonal. Yeah, you have to you have to manually set okay. the diagonals. Okay. Uh, 
um, And thank you all for your help. We appreciate this. <laughs> wait. Oh, all right. <laughs> I'm so sorry. All good? Okay, wait. Upright. This is the internet where button che checks take about 20 minutes. Okay. <laughs> well, it does work. Okay, great. Yeah. <laughs> That's also really important. All the time. This is good. <laughs> yeah. So, special uh, backdashes in this game, I think, are universal. Everyone's got backdash. Not everyone is a forward dash. This is Sailor Moon's forward. Yeah, dash. I know. What? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I have one. Yeah, some characters don't. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So I spent like two seconds like playing this game. Like literally, like a five minutes before stream. Yep. And I got bodied so hard by CPU. Mm -hmm. The CPU is cheap as fuck. Uh, Woo. Whoa. Okay. We got fireballs. I think Usagi's also got Wait. an air fireball. I'm saying. Is it just like a normal emotion? Yeah, I think this game mostly uses like pretty, pretty. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, so it's how. What, core circle back? Yeah, core circle back in the air. Yeah. Um, if I remember correctly... Let's see. I think... Wow. I think you can, you can guard cancel into specials on block. So, like, if, if you go ahead and block this fireball... You basically oh, get a special free... cancel that. Yeah, so you can if you have you figured out what what any of your special moves are yet? No, no idea. Okay, you had that tornado. Uh, I wonder. I if think you... I, I got this weird tornado. All right, yeah, yeah, but I can't tell what I'm doing. That's that's making that happen. It's All not right. like plus two buttons or anything. I'm, I'm gonna like link that, you right? to the move list, by the way. Oh, tight. Okay, cool. Thank you, Terry. We're doing this in real time. Yeah. So basically. Uh, one of the weird systems about this game is that everyone can guard cancel. So you can, you can, if you're in block stun. Oh, she's a, she's a charged character. Oh, I there see. You so you, yeah, so you can guard, you oh, can block this and then immediately cancel the block stun into a special move, including, I think, a back dash. Whoa. Oh, wild. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Okay. That seems to be true. Whoa. Okay. This. Woo. Charge move is wild. Okay, so she's got. Oh my god. Rod lock. She's got knees. machine gun. And then strict. Does she have a forward? She has a, some sort of notation I've never even seen before. <laughs> what Which is one? This? It's like. Oh, is it a. Oh, no, 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 wait, no, no, wait. That is a charge move. Okay, so she's got a charge move. And then she's got and then a half she circle. Has a, she has a, and then she has a half circle. Okay. Also, I like that the I results was screen is called a report card. <laughs> they get those grades. Well, I was just going to say, like, the reason why, like, it's because the, the, the inner century are in middle school, that, like, the, the outer century are, like, in high school, which is, like, why they're the coolest people ever to them. Right. I mean, um, high schoolers were impossibly cool when I was in middle school. I wasn't like allowed to make yeah. eye contact with them or anything. But... Okay, great. Okay, now I. What a wild character. Okay. <laughs> Woo! Ah, so the unfortunate thing about about Sailor Moon's very big dash is that she can't actually attack out of it. Oh, Whoa, chip, really? Chip kill. Yep. <laughs> okay. Desperation moves can be done at low health. Okay, I see. You might be thinking, what could I possibly do with this weird ass air fireball? The answer is cross-ups. 
Oh, nice. Oh my god. Yeah, you can get all the way across the screen that way. Hey. Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that shit's dirty. Oh. <laughs> so now I feel like even though you were in hit set, I took more damage. <laughs> <laughs> Hit him with the wind pose. So they do have their super inputs are like very uh guilty gear X. Yep. Also, what actually lets you do the super? Is it when you're low health enough that you, your idol changes? Yeah. It's you've gotta be low health or oh my god. <laughs> that really like gets you over a lot of my shit. Let's see, what are what are Moon's other moves? Oh, that's right. She's got a. She's got the wine. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and and her recovery, she looks sheepish. It's cute as fuck. Yeah, that's really adorable. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So yeah. Uh, Terry's saying you can super comes when you're when you're at low health and your idol changes, or uh, if uh, time is running low and the, the heart starts flashing. Interesting. Oh, we got we got mashable oh, throws in this game, baby. <laughs> oh my god! What a comeback! <laughs> well, and their throws are done with different buttons, huh? I think it's it's a basically a Street Fighter 2 style throw. Huh. So forward, forward heavy punch, forward heavy kick should all work, I think. Oh, uh, okay. Or maybe it's just... Well, it's no, actually... Yeah, you're right. No, and on the move list, I guess it's specified per character. And some have multiple throws and some don't. Also, this game has a lot of VO for a SNES game. That's really impressive. Yeah, it's kind of... It feels like it must be taken from the show because they sound so much like... I, know, I mean, I know it's the era, but it's very, like, bit crushed. Yeah. Um. Oh, good blocks. <laughs> oh, wow. Got the spinning bird kick. <laughs> Oh shit! <laughs> I've gotta say, wait, well, I'm gonna see Mercury's throw. What does she do? Oh. Uh, let's see it here. Oh! <laughs> oh that's. <laughs> it's like a DDT. Their throws are so funny. Yeah, so that's. Oh wow, that's look my at that crazy thing. wall jump. Yep. That's, so my favorite thing about this game is that when like when it comes to their attacks, it's punches and kicks, whatever, right? They got their signature special moves from the game from the show, and then their throws are all pro wrestling like dirty shit, right? right they're so wild, and this mobility is crazy. Yeah. Let's see, Mercury. Oh my God, I think she has like a Mercury has like a tiger knee move. Mercury Look. Aqua Mirage, yeah, that looks like, yeah, that's definitely like a Tiger Knee. Um. Woo, footsies. Oof. <laughs> oh. Oh shit. Oh, that almost works. Oh. Hey. Oh shit. So when you were asking like, oh, which Sailor Moon game is it? I, I was looking at the fight K list. I was like, oh shit. I forgot that there's like 18 SNES Sailor Moon games. Not even and counting the like the, the big oh! Zam edition ROM hack. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, nice. Wow, you don't need any time at all to do these. Oh! I do wish it had a combo meter. Oh. Yeah, that's... <laughs> I just want to know when my stuff's real, you know? Yeah, right? Tell, tell me if it's a black beat. I can take it. I thought I was a low profile that one second. Yata. Yeah, it, it thank you. looks like it was a low profile. But All right. it was not. Oh. Let's see. I know, so I remember playing Jupiter and Uranus and them having some real broken shit. Uh, yeah, I know that I've seen Uranus do some stuff that looks truly deep. She's fucking red. hilarious. Fuck it. Let's get this. Let's get this one out of the way. Ooh, you yeah, want to just pick Uranus and try some mirrors real quick? Cause she's she's funny as fuck. Uh, which character? Uh, Uranus. Oh yeah, yeah. Go. You should play her. I'm gonna play. I'll play Neptune. Okay. Neptune. Um. Yeah, I wanna see her. I wanna see her. Her dirty shit. Lover's quarrel, here we go. <laughs> oh man, what am I gonna do Whoa, about what? this? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, okay! Holy <laughs> <God>! <laughs> 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 Oh, the zoning. Let's see, what was it? Oh, okay, oh, man grab me. Oh! Oh no! Oh, oh man, I just fucking oh, died with that foot. <laughs> Damn, she puts out a violin in the wind <laughs> Oh, I got a DP too, let's go. Oh. Whoa! Wait, it looks like you backdashed it, but then you got caught in it somehow. Oh. There we go. Oh my god! That's <laughs> Epkin Buster! Holy crap, that damage! <laughs> oh no, not quite. <laughs> I'm not. Uh, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what is. What damage! <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Alright, there you go. There's there's the world shaking. Oh. Oh. oh no! Ooh. Oh, it's slide. No! Oh, not quite. <laughs> <laughs> no. So one of the things about this the game classic is, footies. yeah, one of the things about this game is because everyone can guard cancel uh, specials or are out of block stun into a special. Oh, right? I keep forgetting that. And uh, Neptune, I believe it's Uranus and Jupiter. Uranus and Jupiter have one frame command grabs. So if you are ever, if you make them block, you are at risk of just eating a command grab. Oh dear. Okay. If you're like too close to them. Yeah. Or. So that's what I was trying to do, but you were you were at a good enough range that I was just whiffing the grab instead. Oh. Oh, good punish. Oh, too short. Oh, I saw a whiff animation. Yep. Yeah, this game had whiff animations, had command throw whiff animations before Street Fighter did. Oh my god, that's wild, actually. 
I noticed that you can set your buttons in. Oh my god. <laughs> At the oh, I thought I was dead already. Deep is the magic. Deep is the magic. Also, uh, Uranus's fireball input is forward to down, which is kind of cool. Whoa! I think I, my guess is because it kind of matches the movement that she does. Yeah, because it's kind of like. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> Oh. Oh, down. So that's Sailor Uranus. The other, the other fucked up, broken shit. All right, yeah, let's Jupiter. try some. All right. <laughs> yeah, Sailor Mars has a Frankensteiner. <laughs> like all of these. It's so funny to see, like. The name of this like special move, like Venus Love Me Chain, and then yep. there's like, oh yeah, her throw is me machine, machine gun. gun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, giant swing. Okay, that's insane. so Jupiter. Unfortunately, does not have that full screen dash that uh, Uranus has. Whoa. She does have this though. That's pretty good. Oh. Oh, we got the Ayori kick. Okay. Not... Well, it's not. Well, about Ooh. as generous as that expense. Oh! Matt Reed. Oh my god, the trade. Oh! Oh, nice. Oh my god, this anti air fireball is, is insane. It's funny. Uh, the other day, Irene was asking me, like, hey, does anyone else have a fireball that works like Rams, like the up forward fireball? In uh, in in Rev oh, 2, yeah. I was like, oh yeah, no, Sailor Mars. Sailor Mars. <laughs> yeah, that is such a weird fireball. <laughs> um, okay. Fire oh, 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 we got we got charge. Okay. Oh, okay. Hey. Whoa, we've got kind of like mirror ability. Yep. Oh. I think that trade worked out even though you blocked and I didn't. <laughs> oh. Yeah, sometimes the damage on block, at least for Jupiter's moves, seems crazy. Alright. Yes! Oh, no, I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> I was like, shit. <laughs> Do I have a DP? No. Uh, I should have done that fire heal drop though. Okay, let's see. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Somehow we both missed. That was crazy. Actually, it is it is kind of interesting, like the size of the characters relative to the projectiles in this game. Like, it's it's it seems easier to tall. navigate around a projectile in this game than it is in Street Fighter 2. Hmm, yeah. Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> the electrical effect is really amazing. Yeah. This this feels like Toho again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it really does. Oh, oh no. <laughs> Oh, I, I get to move her around while she's doing that. That's kind of cool. Oh. Ah! <laughs> oh. Whoa. Oh, and they give you the the name of the the special move when you finish with it. Oh, that's Wait. interesting. Okay, I'll change. All right. Who else do we got? All right, I'm picking Sailor Venus now. Okay. Um, yeah, who? 
Uh, All right, which of the Sailor Senshi has the Ojo Sama laugh? Mars? I mean, Mars is like right up Sky's alley, right? They all kind of do it. Ah. I mean, when they're in the mood, too. Sure. Sure. Let's see. This is what the the aquatic park or something. There's. Mm. All right, we're gonna go with this one. This is nice. All right. All right. Uh, so I just get a regular fireball. Whoa, this one's fast. Whoa! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that it just goes! Um. Alright, we got, we got fireball battles. Oh! Wow, that's so dirty! She could just, like... She could just play the Fireball War and then she can mix you up with her forward dash. Yep. So, she has an air fireball that's, uh, back, like, core circle back and punch when you're in the air. Uh-huh. And oh, at that yeah. height, it's not that useful. But what you can do is, if you're fast, you can back dash. In the, during the back dash, you're airborne. So if you get a core circle back punch w during the back dash, you get that fireball at the ground level. Oh, okay, wait. So try it out real quick. Just try back dash. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, I see what you're saying. Yeah, and so if you're low to the ground, then you can cross up with the, the four dash from there. That's wild. Oh, I think there's a throw tag. Yeah. I, I, lo I love her fucking Belmont ass whip right here, too. Oh, oh time over. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, she's also got a flash kick as well. That yeah, that's her. That's the <laughs> the the yelling anti-air. Oh, okay, gotcha. <laughs> flash kick, yelling. All right, let's let's try. Chibi man. So she's got some sort of slang and normal. She's got a double jump. Oh god, Chibi, Chibi's a weird one. <laughs> Look at how yep. tiny she is. Get in the corner, <laughs> one. Oh my god. Ooh! Combos. <laughs> oh, I couldn't throw you. Okay. okay, I can still. My standing fierce uh, does oh, not shit. whiff on you, though. This is, this is good. Wait, actually, can you just can you just walk back real quick? Just hold back. Okay, okay. I wanted to see if they'd let that whiff on on Chibi. Oh, <laughs> uh, this one. Yeah. Uh, wait. Yeah. So in this game, I guess Chibi Moon for oh, whatever reason can, can backdash, can loop her backdash over and over. Oh wow! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. So wait, you can really? you can you can timer scam just like this. What the heck? This is silly. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> this is actually the most fun I've ever heard you have playing fighting games. This is amazing. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> <laughs> I've never like played with something that truly broken before. Yep. Well, and so I think the 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 drama that was happening because every every fighting game community has had drama in this last year, and my understanding is that the Sailor Moon community's drama was deciding whether to ban Chibi Moon or not. <laughs> Y'all in chat can let me know if that's accurate or not. That's what I heard. <laughs> 
Also, thank you very much for the help, Terry. Appreciate it. <sighs> I'm just having a conniption over. <laughs> There's no recovery. This just in. <laughs> Fighting games? They're hard to make. <laughs> they really are. And this game probably took like six months or something like that, which is not that long. Yeah, I'm, I'm always like, I hey, think that I feel months. like we can't. Ooh. It's so important to think about how these games were made. Yeah. On like what we consider like an indie solo developer is what like a lot of AAA development in the past was. Yeah. Like, people are just saying, I don't know if you were looking at that uh, oral history of uh, um, Street Fighter 3. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Um, but one of the things that I saw in it was that, like, there was, like, one programmer who did, like, all of the, the all of, like, the game design mm -hmm. for for Street Fighter 2 and Vampire was yeah. done by this one programmer guy, yeah. basically. So like, just imagine if one person did all of the ballots for for the comp a competitive fighting game. Like that's yep. wild to think of. And this, and this is like doing, I can imagine one person doing the balance for a competitive fighting game in 2020 when we have literal decades of history with this genre, right? Right, but he was just making it up. Yeah. He's like, there is nothing. Fighting games have existed for like three years at this point. Like, And like most of what we think of as fighting games was made by that one dude. Cause that's what he- Yeah, that yeah shout to Neo G. Neo G is the reason that fighting games are like somewhat playable these days. All right, let's see oh how easy this is. <laughs> Wait, can I throw this? <laughs> oh, so yeah, I think uh, Ben Reed was saying that what you have to do is is find a way to cross her up. That's because that'll oh, that'll right, really yeah, because it'll. It oh, there you go. Now I was losing, so that was dumb. But you know. <laughs> what well, record? You chilling? Yeah, I like these whip normals that she's got. Yep. The bison slide. What? Oh, that's interesting. This is, I, I forget, I think, I think this is how gravity works in, in Street Fighter as well, but you almost never see it because they don't get high enough. But uh, your rate of acceleration while falling increases over time, is my oh, guess. Oh, that's interesting. It, it works like that in Guilty Gear, too. There's, there's like, if I'm trying to combo off into or off of chips, like uh, the drill kick that he does, I can, I can get it more consistently if I go really, really high first. Oh, huh. Yeah, because of... Ooh. I think I got it. Is that tie? Oh, no. Alright. Huh. Gosh, I'm going to try Venus again because I wasn't looking at her when we were set. Alright. Uh, I'll give Pluto a shot. Dead do scream. It's really dramatic. I I and love the way they it. sell Dead Scream in the show, where they just they just don't play any background music. Yeah, she shoots like a little. I remember it being like a pink orb. Mm -hmm. Wow, here's it. Venus is is very tall. I feel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Huh. And for this, they were just like, fuck it, we're making it a tornado. This is too much of a pain in the ass. Oh. 
Pluto also continued oh, the tradition. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> From Pluto. Pluto is also continuing the tradition of having a long ass staff, but not that many long ass staff attacks. Yeah, I was like, I was a little bit hoping for her to have like the the big normals. Right. But actually, that's kind of Venus because she's got this this whip. Get back to me. Get back to me. Whoa. Okay. What? Get back to me. Yeah, it's like an anti-air projectile, right? Yeah, that's so weird. And it's done with like a flash kick motion. Yep. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Wait, I haven't tried Jupiter yet. You haven't tried who? Jupiter. Ah. I guess I haven't played Uranus either. We'll, we'll, we'll stick with Pluto for a couple more games. Jupiter Coconut Cyclone. Yeah, that shit is good as fuck. <laughs> and but, she also has... Wow, well, that's with a very... That's with like a reverse fireball motion? Yeah, it's oh, forward yeah, to that's down. This. And I think you can do it out of your back dash as well. Oh, yeah. Oh. Wow, what a... That is a wild input to get used to. Yep. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that's gonna hurt. The chip damage is. I think too it actually. Much. I think it might do more damage on block than on hit. <laughs> I remember somebody in like. I like I said. I watched one tournament. I remember somebody saying like that there were some projectiles that did more damage on block than on hit. <laughs> Woo. -hoo. I forget somewhere somewhere there's like a, a a video compilation that's like a timeline of all this the Sailor Moon tech found throughout the years. I think it's in Japanese. I forget where it is, but that Ooh, shit was that cool as fuck. Cool. If any of you in chat remember what this is, I might want to check this out on stream later. Yeah, I would I would I would love to watch that. Damn. I can't believe Jupiter has like a command grab and and all that, yeah. And all that. <laughs> also, did, was was it just me or was Pluto not showing a heart when she got electrocuted? She's covering it. Oh. Oh, oh she's covering it with her. <laughs> huh. All right. Well, that Jupiter is a wild character. All right, I'll play Uranus. Yeah, you, you got to try Uranus. <laughs> I mean, I was like, okay. she has died before, right? Yeah. yeah, okay. I think all of the outer century died at one point. I mean, everyone dies, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's true, but they're also still in the oh. show after. Oh, wow, Mercury is surprisingly mobile. I yeah, she has this uh, wall jump thing. She's got the wall jump, and I think she's got the fast. It looks like she's got a really fast walk speed. Yeah, she does actually. Wow, look at that! Yep. Oh my god, this, yep. these dashes are crazy. <laughs> They're so godlike. Hey! Oh no, you tech! Yeah, that's, I was trying to throw you. Oh, that's right. Uranus has an infinite too. Oh, nice. Jesus. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Uranus Infinite is crouching light punch, crouching heavy punch, forward dash. Oh, that's right. How did... So, this game doesn't use links, right? Or, or does it? Ugh. It feels like CPS one chains to me, chat. It has links? Okay. Yeah. You can backdash out of anything. Right right backdash away from all of your problems. Oh my god, what a red up throw! But why backdash <laughs> away from your problems when you could just walk up and DDT them? <laughs> Oh my god, my turn game is bad in these old school games. <laughs> uh, oh. oh, good attack. Oh, there was Mercury Aqua Mirage. There we go. Oh. Yo, go for the command grab. Oh, not quite. <laughs> oh, oh no! <laughs> oh, yeah, am I, am I 360? Well, I don't know if I've, I've... I've never played a grappler character before. Mm. Um, so am I like... I feel like there was a character. Actually, I did play. I played Sarah Bell in Skullgirls, so I guess I kind of had. I almost had yeah. Grappler experience. She's cool as hell. That was a, a long time ago. Yeah, I really liked Sarah Bell. Also, has anyone in chat tried the ROM hacks where they got like Sailor Moon versus Ninja Turtles and shit? Because I saw some of that over here. I did see that in Fight Can. I was like, wait, that doesn't look official. Like, I want, I definitely oh, yeah. want to try that. That was the thing is that it was like I searched for Sailor Moon and found that this ROM, this was not one of the Sailor Moon games because it's yeah. like spelled as one word and it's just yeah, 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 got exactly. the Shoujo Senshi in it. <laughs> Whoa! Oh. Oh my god. Woo! Oh wow, that hit standing, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yeah, I think because I went into an attack animation, maybe? Mm. That's my instinct. Nope. Oh, I, I guess you're... Yeah, I think I think this is standing, probably not crouching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's it. Oh. Uh, that does a lot of damage whether you block it or not. Hey, yo, get slapped. <laughs> that's that's what All you right. get for trying well. to keep out your girl Mars. <laughs> <laughs> God damn, this shit's fast. Oh no, nice. Whoa. Hey. Oh no. <laughs> Damn, and what, when Mars wins, she just fucking laughs at your shit. <laughs> yeah, Mars really does like to laugh. Alright, I'm going back to you. Let me go back to Neptune. Coconut loops. Alright. Who do I want? I'll spend some more time with Mercury. She seems pretty cool. Alright, let's see. Yeah, her mobility and all of these moves. The amount of charge moves there on this game is wild. Ooh. I'm, 
I'm enjoying the walk speed here. Yeah, that is wild. Oh. Neptune's got a lot of reach, though. Woo! Oh, nice trade. <laughs> Not quite sure how that how it did, but. Yo! Wow, what the was that? Oh, wait, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pulling out the violin. Neptune playing the world's tiniest violin. <laughs> oh. Yo, let's see your super. Oh yeah, how do I do this? It looks like it's tap forward and then fireball, fireball, punch. All right. Oh, that might have been it. Yeah, I think that was it yeah. actually. That was cool. Yeah, it's uh, some sort of weird DP. Also, it's interesting that it looks like this is supers before super flashes or slow down or anything existed. Yeah, it just, there was nothing. It just yeah, it did just a pops. And I think you can do that as many times as you want if I'm reading this correctly. Yeah, I think once you're, once you're in the zone, it's like a, it's like, uh, whatchamacallit, the fucking desperation mode in, in, in KOF games. Mm-hmm. Oh, we're all right. So Ben Reed is saying that super is actually a double dragon punch motion. Oh, okay. I've never seen that in my life. That is that is wild. I can't believe I actually did it. Wait. Okay. How do we do this? How did you work again? Okay. Yeah. You have the half circle. Whoa. Damn, it's hard to yeah, hit it feels knee. It like it. Whoa, which what is that move? Ooh. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! 
I'll take that trade. Oh. Hey, he throws. <laughs> God, the tick throws. <laughs> I think, yeah. I don't know when when throws stopped being immediate in fighting games, but I feel like that was the case for most of the SNES uh, generation, at least. Yeah. Yeah, my experience with this area of era of fighters is actually like it's actually really low. Like the the very first Guilty Gear X was actually I think the first fighting game that I like bought and owned. No fun. And had in my house. Yeah, it it absolutely was. Yeah, now that I think about it, for sure, because I didn't have anything on. I was like pretty young when I had my Genesis, so. Um, Uh, so yeah, it was, it was definitely Guilty Gear. It was, I think it was Guilty Gear. I rented Guilty Gear X and then I bought Guilty Gear XX. The Midnight Carnival. Oh, hell um, So like, not that I like played that competitively, so I don't think there's any, I mean, or even like remotely. I, I don't think anyone played X competitively. <laughs> I never, I never saw people playing it until XX. And that was because they had it in Sunnyvale. Whoa. Oh. oh my god. Damn, he really do have some hitboxes on him because that did not look real. Ah. Even remotely. No! <laughs> We're just breathing on it. They kind of look like just smooching. We're gonna breathe on each other as hard as we possibly can. Oh. oh, nice. Trying to do her super. Oh, oh shit! Oh my god! <laughs> I think I did her super. I <laughs> think you might have. <laughs> I was not ready for that one. Cool. <laughs> Thanks, this handy dandy move list. <laughs> The air time on this. Oh my god. <laughs> this really does feel like the Toho game in a lot of ways. Ooh, fuck. There's there's this fantastic <laughs> moment of animation or of, of anticipation on that throw too. Like just just a little bit of, of like, oh you see what's about to happen to you, right? Ugh. Oh. That's the, the guard cancel bullshit. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, that's why oh that's why you're able to to just throw me out of nonsense. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I see. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Dang, that's so wild! <laughs> yeah, so the, the counterplay to that is if you think I'm about to do that, then you have to backdash cancel whatever it is you're doing. Oh, whatever I'm doing. Oh, okay. I'm like, I, I'm absorbing those old school fundamentals. Exactly. <laughs> Like, oh shit, I made him block something? I'm fucked. That's old school fundamentals. Yes! Ooh. Old footsies. Oh! Hey, thank you, Bone Boys. Appreciate it. Oh, no! <laughs> That's what you get for trying oh, to attack so much Oh, my God! <laughs> Damn. Unsafe on block. Starting to see where this game like layers, AV. There's layers. Layers, to this. layers indeed. <laughs> Hopefully, don't let somebody out of block stunned. <laughs> oh. Well, you're sure she's a long way away from you. <laughs> Oh. I'm fine. Oh with that. my god, the recovery. Oh, nice. Oh. Alright, back down to speed. No! Woo! You hit me out of super startup there. <laughs> oh shit. Wow. Did someone in chat really should roll up here and say that Love Live is Sailor Moon but with singing and dancing instead of magic transformations? <laughs> As someone who just started Man, watching Love Live, nah. Anyway, started blasting. <laughs> Love Live is pretty good, though, I gotta say. Hey, what up, Kango? See, the moment we start talking about Love Live, Kango rolls up. <laughs> I'm not sure if I should make that. I feel like... I feel like I could make takes... Oh, no, shit! I attacked you. What was I thinking? <laughs> Shit! Oh! As, oh! As, as Bruce Lee said, it's, it's the art of fighting without fighting. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure when Bruce Lee said that, what he meant was that you should shoot fireballs instead of trying to keep someone in block stun. <laughs> I'm almost positive that's what he meant. <laughs> fireballs don't hit back. <laughs> Yeah, they even have like like character select quote and like round start quotes, right? And not round start, but match start, right? Yeah, they even like yeah when you select them, they have like uh, a voice line. Woo! Oh good, yeah, walk. Oh my god, that dash. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Is that your 360? Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> if you wanted to see it again. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny to me that the 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 giant swing does damage on the swings and not really on the hits. 
Yeah, it's... <laughs> I've always found that to be a very interesting property of, like, moves like that. There's a... There's a grappler at Aquapaza that has something not dissimilar to that. It's, it's funny to me, because I think that is, like, if you were to model, like... So, you know how in pro wrestling, like... There is the rage. There is the idea that this shit takes da does damage, right? <laughs> and I think that if if you were able if you were able to attach like health bars to pro re pro wrestling like video production to show right, you yeah. when someone's taking damage, it, they would show that the giant swing does damage when someone's getting swung. Yeah, you're right, actually, because like otherwise, what what's the point of doing that swing? Yeah, somehow that's like contributing, right? Can I low profile that? Yes, oh, you I sure can. can. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, what a train. That was amazing. <laughs> I, I need to pa parse this this meta analogy here. Kengo saying love live being compared to Sailor Moon is like comparing Macross to Toradora. <laughs> Kengo, you sir, you win That's anime Twitter me. today. Good I'm job. not sure. I'm not sure if I understand it, but I can tell that it's wild. <laughs> Change the stage after this. Oh my god. Damn, Irene hitting herself with the me, myself, and Irene. <laughs> I mean, AV, this would be a great game to learn how to play a grappler if you wanted, you know? Really? <laughs> Would Love Live be better or worse with more crucifixion? <laughs> they do get crucified in Sailor Moon. You know what? I heard that the I think crucifixion scene in Sailor Moon, which is a wild way to put it, even though it's true. God damn. Um, and the crucifixion scene in Evangelion are probably both inspired by the crucifixion scene in Ultraman. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> I did it again. Yeah, there's a scene in Ultraman that like Hideki Anno was like really obsessed with Ultraman. So a lot of a lot of um and apparently the reason why there's a lot of he is picking he is using a lot of Christian imagery that's in Ultraman yeah. because the director of Ultraman was like Catholic. Okay. Um This is the thing that I have heard. Um and so Anna yeah, is just like, hey, that looks cool. Let me use that. Yeah. So Eva is. So Eva goes like. <laughs> I can just see the URL. <laughs> yeah, 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 right? Yeah. Look at the whole the Ultraman getting crucified. Like. <laughs> yeah, it looks like. Yeah, like Hideki Auto like, took all, like, a huge amount of stuff from this show. So like all that Christian imagery, like Hideki Anno doesn't know anything about this, but this guy was a huge Catholic. So that's what he took all this stuff from. <laughs> I, I was not aware like... that Ultraman died for our sins. <laughs> oh, you didn't know? It's in the... <laughs> it's in the Ultra Testament. <laughs> he read... <laughs> Have I seen Gridman? God, I watched like the first half of the season. I still haven't finished it. 
I really want to because I really liked it. I, I would say it's worth finishing. Yeah, I've heard a lot of good things about it. I really want to. Um, do people get crucified in it? <laughs> I don't. I don't remember any crucifixions. <laughs> There's a new, there's a new uh, grid man coming out too. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Oh shit. I need to press the button. I'm getting used to the interpreter. Mm -hmm. These little games. <laughs> it's 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 kind of interesting to think about how much. A relatively small thing like that affects the game feel. Yeah, so oh. much. Oh my god. Crack shoot! Right, the recovery on that is a lot. <laughs> No! You hit me out of my super again. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it's not invincible. <laughs> a wiki for crucifixions in anime would be really good. I have have I told you about my idea for like the Twitter bot that I really want? Which is a bot that is like, do they destroy Australia? Oh right, yeah. And it's just <laughs> <laughs> okay, I did talk about it on this stream. I really want that to happen. Oh my oh god! My. <laughs> oh. I really think that I'm playing Toho right now. <laughs> oh no! Too far away. I've got to say, the forward to down motion actually feels kind of cool on a stick. Yeah, I don't think it's a- I actually don't think it's bad. I haven't played too many games that have something like that in it, but... Yeah, I think- I, I'm a, I mostly remember, like, Nakaru has a move that does this. Alright, there we go. Oh, no, 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 no. Still not enough. Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Yeah, every Gundam, like, Gundam destroyed Australia. And I think it's specifically where, like, I mean it specifically in the sense of, like, when Australia gets fridged. Right. Like, just to show, not like it's a big plot point or anything like that. So Mad Max doesn't count. It has to be a show in which Australia was destroyed just to show that you live in a fucked up future. Right, or, like, Australia basically off screen or something, right? <laughs> Right, it has to like happen happen off screen. So if you're like in the gritty cyberpunk year of two thousand and 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 twenty, Australia is, has been destroyed, and it never like there's no there's no reference to it or anything. Yeah, it's then, just uh, it's just a background fact. Right. Damn, Sailor Moon seems strong. <laughs> So oh, I remember shit. that part in Sailor Moon where she just like grabbed that yokai and just like <laughs> headbutted it like five times and there was like all that blood? That was fucking crazy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, there's a ton of crucifixion in Sailor Moon. <laughs> I don't really know why. Well, it's very Christian. I mean, like, I mean, it's gotta, is the, it's she's the be, messiah. It's gotta be like the equivalent of finding kanji and shit that has no Japanese people or anything working on it, right? Like, yeah. Oh. Absolutely, right? Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> Where to God? Yeah, girl. You wonder where Soul Bad Guy's protagonist power came from. It came from Sailor Moon. <laughs> oh, fuck. 
Oh. Yeah. Yes! Oh my god! Hmm. I need to remember. I remember, Pat, I remember that time when I was like, it was only, only a year ago that I was like, hey, how do I actually do a wake up DP? Mm -hmm. And now I do it annoyingly frequently in, in Guilty Gear. You've come so far. It took, I've come so far. It took a year to get to the point where you can do it. Now it's going to take another year to the point where you stop. Yeah. I really, I'm already like, oh cool, I can do this, and now I'm like, oh, I guess I have to stop trying to do this. <laughs> but I was able to do it very reliably with Elfeld's cake super, yeah. to the point where it, it started changing the way that the group played a little bit. I forget, um, you're, pl you're playing on Hitbox, right? Yeah, I'm playing on Hitbox. So there is, there is one thing that I found out after uh, Wednesday Night Fights last week. Which is that, and then, and it's not just in in Guilty Gear. It's in a lot of games. You can actually do a DP by holding forward and then uh, pianoing your fingers on back and down, and then pressing oh, really? the, yeah, whatever button. And it makes it easy to do it Wait, really back quickly. And which down? Is just kind of neat. Yeah, back and down. So you hold forward, you press back and down. Oh, weird. Huh. Unfortunately, Sailor, Ju Sailor Jupiter does not have a DP input to try it out on, but... <laughs> oh, oh my god, the Lariat. Oh, no. What is this? Okay. Oh, oh my god. Oh shit. I'm getting people advise me on the on some really dirty stuff here. When you quarter someone as as Neptune just spam light DP. Alright, I'm gonna do that on Pat next time. Alright. <laughs> oh. Oh no! Oh, 
fuck. <laughs> Woo! I, I look away for one second. I'm like trying to read the, the, the super <laughs> description. And then I look back. I'm like, oh, that ship killed. I'm dead now. All right. You're trying Mercury, was it? Uh, I'm going back to Neptune. Okay. I will try doing try Mercury Endless thing. DPs. Oh, it was, no, it was Neptune that spams Light Punch DP. Never mind. All right. Yeah, that's, yeah, that, that's the one I was. All right. Well, I will do my best to resist. Meanwhile, we're going to uh, Silver... Hmm? Uh oh. Oh, that's a bit because of she is confused. There's so many. Oh my god. I, I, getting used to how weird the different DP inputs are between these characters. Yep. Is. Guard cancels. Oh, nice. Oh, that was she. <laughs> Hello, Big Zam. Are you the Big Zam that has the ROM hack version? I was gonna say, Big Z once we produce Big, mass produce Big Zam. Uh, there'll be no stopping us. By the way, just so y'all in chat know, I wanted to get AV playing Gundam Wing today, but unfortunately I couldn't get the ROM working on Fight Cage. One of these days we will play Gundam Wing for sure, though. I played a few a few um, minutes of Cyberbox. Oh, nice. Um, and that game was really wild. Yeah, it's real. I was like, from just looking at the game, I was not sure why that was like an immaterial and missing power inspiration. But after playing it for like a couple of minutes, I was like, oh, I definitely understand. Mm -hmm. um, oh my gosh. Okay. Oh. Oh, nice. There you go. Use those legs. Oh shit, wow, that was really safe. Oh my god. Woo. Oh, thank oh. God. Her light DP is safe. <laughs> you have to punish it with dark card again. Yep. <laughs> That's really funny. Now let's do more of her. She's fun. Alright. I gotta go back to uh, Uranus. Full screen command dash into command grab is way too much fun. <laughs> also, Big Zam, since I don't have your ROM edit, what is different in your version? God, it's so scary when you teleport <laughs> right into my face. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit. There we go. <laughs> Alright, maybe that wasn't the best idea. At least idea. I'm on the board. Oh fuck. Wow. <laughs> the Ume showed you coming out. Wow. So Uranus the Super is half circle back, half circle forward. Wow, that's a wild one. Oh my god. Woo. 
Oh shit. Okay. Oh, the chip kill. Damn. Hey, what up, Narod? <laughs> the danger is only. I, I love that. So I love that bad, image man. so much. <laughs> I can hear Irene cackling immediately in response. <laughs> Oh fuck. Ah, damn it. God, the the range is crazy. Oh god. Footsies. Ah, footsies. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you can't just call slide footsies. <laughs> oh, it's it's not just slide. It's the slide and then the back dash to keep it safe. Oh my god. Oh my god, wait. I hate this. Oh, shit. What? How did you throw me? How did oh you my slide, back dash, and then throw me out of my projectile startup? Holy crap. Did I ever tell you I wrote a book on fighting games, AV? That's right. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's fair. <laughs> You're like, oh, anime players don't have fundamentals. <laughs> and this motherfucker wrote a whole book about him. <laughs> it really is footsies when, when Uranus and Neptune does it. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. There we go. I feel like I'm fighting a fucking... Like you have the instant transfer. <laughs> Jeez. Alright. Oh. I remember seeing on Twitter someone saying, uh, for a good time, just, just search lesbians fighting. But I don't think that this is quite what they had expected. <laughs> Woo! Oh Oh my god, the mix. <laughs> oh, that's wild. So even when the hit happens all the way over there, I can just cancel. I can just yeah. backdash cancel out of <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> I was trying to do my super. Uh, you're thinking of ultimate surrender, I think. <laughs> Shit. I asked oh the classic god, whiff punish so into one frame throw. Oh my god. <laughs> Jeez. All right. <laughs> My flights to paint the forward dash are a good idea to catch her coming in. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much, Orlando, for yeah. blatantly coaching me. Just the homie <laughs> He is I a fixture so from the insert credit forms from back in the day. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh my god. Uh. 
Oh yeah, actually, uh, one of my coaches, one of my old jujitsu coaches, went to go like watch some Ultimate Surrender. They they did a couple live performances that you could go watch in the audience. Oh my god, the psychic DP. <laughs> I can tell you're aggressive levels. Also, that that person is safe, so. <laughs> oh fuck. Alright. <laughs> that one came! That one was a very obvious read, I'm gonna say. Ah. <gasps> no! <laughs> <laughs> I am feeling that my people love this game because it's actually really good. <laughs> yeah. It just lets you get get away. It's very simple and letting, and yet it lets you get away with quite a lot of of, of nonsense. Oh yeah. Just no, straight nonsense. This this is why bad fighting games are usually better than good fighting games. That's a really good point. <laughs> I feel like a tagline, like, who cares about balance? Yeah. Game, or games were better when they weren't balanced would be a really good... <laughs> oh, let's have Uranus mirrors by accident. All right, we're doing it. Um, I feel like I was talking about this, maybe not in this stream, but um, remember that, that guy who beat this Marvel 3 tournament? Um, with like uh, Rocket Raccoon. Yeah, Kusoru. I was actually just talking about Irene with that that set. He beat, uh, I think it was F Champ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he had some some really sick anti Phoenix tech with like Frank West. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, actually, I, I, he think, had, like, I think he was the one. I think you're right. I think he was the one with Ra Rocket Raccoon. I forget if he also had the Frank West one or not. Um, he may have. I remember he was running a very unusual team. He had some sort of. Um. um I forgot. I right, am Merlin <laughs> said he kept on holding <laughs> up his copy of Sengoku Basara X. I do remember that. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so that's the specific moment I was thinking of. Is that he when he won he held he held that up because he really liked the game and yeah. he Really One of these days we should play it. I've only played it and had a really fun. bad time, but it is an Arc System Works game that was published by right. Capcom. Right, and it was, uh, I think it's it's kind of on the level of, of um, uh, uh, Fist of the North Star. Woo! Uh, oh my god. I think I won that one, didn't I? I think you did. <laughs> That's <laughs> hey, this character is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if anyone has said that before. <laughs> oh, we should really play it. You know what? We re oh my god, why? I why couldn't tell which one of us got that grab to be honest. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, the, the whiff <laughs> grab punish. <laughs> yeah, it's just going in and out. <laughs> oh, oh wow. I dare you. I dare you. Do some shit. And oh, no! I thought I'd tell back in. <laughs> um, uh, we should play Ultra Fight D Kianta. Yes, we point. should play Kianta. Oh, really? That's where I'm like, a, kind of like a tour of... Yeah. Tour of games. I kind of actually... If we want to start... We want to think about themes. I'd actually be kind of curious to play some of the the old school games. Like, I've wanted to play CVS too, oh, just yeah. because I know that was like one of your origin games. Oh yeah. Um, 
That actually works. Can I live at? It's okay on Fightcade. I think that Null DC is a little bit better. We we can get that set up for sure though. I kind of I I would love to just like hear you tell me about that game like while we play it. Sure. And and absorb the knowledge. I would I would be happy to. I have at numerous points called it the Grateful Dead of fighting games because it was yeah, incredibly formative <laughs> to the people who were there. <laughs> But anyone else who comes to it afterwards, you're like, why is this so loud? And just keep, why does it keep going on? That sounds fantastic. I actually have like kind of a weakness for Dad Rock, so I have like this idea that I might, I might enjoy it. Or at least I'll enjoy the experience of learning about it. Yeah. Maybe we'll do that next time. I had actually, so stream, I had asked AV what she thought was the most, the cyberpunk fighting game um, in honor of the buzzword that's on everyone's lips this week. And uh, we couldn't really come up with anything. Yeah, hey. I'm struggling to think of them. Hey, what like I said, here's what I said. I said Phantom Dust. I said, like, whatever that Psychic Force game was, mm -hmm. um, and I don't think Virtual On, I think you can't say Virtual On. It's, it's just, it's lacking the punk. Because, right? yeah, it has no punk. It is yeah. all cyber, no punk. Um, so it's, and it's very cyber. We it can, is very cyber. We can cyber. definitely give it that. <laughs> incredibly cyber. Extremely cyber and incredibly punk. One must fall. Um, hmm. One must fall. Oh yeah, awesome, thank you. I think Akatsuki, actually, no, but Akatsuki Blitzkampf is like... There's too much um, Nazi for it to be punk, right? Yeah, well, it's too, it's like steampunk, ah. you know? Like, and, and that, <laughs> for sure. <laughs> Slap happy rhythm busters. <laughs> that does not sound very cyberpunk. Power Instinct. Wait, which was Power Instinct 3 ma Matcha Melee? Oh, Is wait, it... wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait. Actually, I have a really good answer to it now. Oh, let's go. Rise 2 Resurrection. Oh, shit. Rise of the Robots. That kind of like Mortal Kombat, like, F, like CG, like, um,. Cyber is a bunch of robots fighting each other. Okay. I think I feel like we're we're beginning to build up some possible theme collections. I'm into it. All right. Has anyone heard of this game? Rise of the Robots 2 Resurrection. Okay. It is currently it is 1020. We got 10 minutes left in the stream. Let's play first to three. This one's for all the oh. Mars. Oh, okay. Alright. Um, That's right. Supreme Champion Mars. of the Universe. Uh I gotta play Uranus. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Bio freaks. Game like Bio freaks definitely sounds cyberpunk. Yeah. So I'm not gonna argue. Perfect. Maybe maybe cyborg justice P the PVP mode. Oh my god. The whiff punishes fundamentals. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> the whiff punish dash command grab. Wow, that did hit low. Oh shit. Oh. Little, little too tall. Okay, there we go. Ooh. All right. <laughs> I gotta make her think I'm gonna do something that's not just dash. <laughs> In fighting games, it's very important to represent more than one option to load up your opponent's mental stack. 
So you can do that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Ah! Whoa! Oh no! <laughs> All right. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Oh. So <laughs> fundamental. <laughs> I think this might be the only fighting game that has an arcade in it. That, like, yeah. I, I can't think of other stage, like other arcade stages in fighting. I mean, uh, well, uh, so she has, she, her stage in five is her backyard. It's the same as Alpha 2. Oh, KOF 95 is Neo Geo Land. That's right. I kind of wish that they'd do like a Samurai Showdown stage for like five special. Oh. Mortal Kombat doesn't actually look like an arcade though, right? You're talking about the new stage, right? Oh, fuck. I'm sitting here being lucky that AV is missing her special move inputs. <laughs> oh! Ah! Uh. Alright, Big Zam reminding Max's us that if you input directions too fast, the game will drop them. Which, especially on Hitbox, is definitely a liability. Oh, if it's too fast. Okay, I thought I wasn't doing them fast enough. Because I could tell something was messing them up. Oh, jeez. Damn, this is cheap as hell. Wait, you can backdash cancel with normals? Oh, jeez. Oh, All right. <laughs> All right. I woke AV up. She's down 2-0. Winners for grand finals. <laughs> now this is where she gets serious. Oh. Sorry. I, oh. I misinputted and selected Pluto. All right. Does it... We'll see... I don't think it'll let us quit. I think it's just a pause. Yeah, I don't think yeah, there's a pause not. menu. Yeah, all right. Beat me up real quick. We need to play that. <laughs> all right, the bold counter pick. <laughs> hmm. Woo. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it'll be faster if you... Yeah. <laughs> Backdash canceling whiffed normals is so weird. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, yeah, you can even do like an air landing into an immediate backdash. I wouldn't be surprised if that worked in Guilty Gear too. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god. Oh, the footsies. Gotta, gotta go back to playing neutral. I got ahead of myself. <laughs> Well. <laughs> Alright, AV on the board. The the accidental Pluto counterpick working out for her. 
<laughs> yeah, accidental Toledo counter pick. Oh, nice. Oh. The zoning, too effective. I can't get in. <laughs> Oh, I hit the Whoa, silver! What? That's so much Yo! damage. Oh my god, was that like a one hit? In the moment 38 right here, baby! <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. That was wild. I did not expect that to finish that with a full wild. damage unfailed oh. grab. That was like 70%. God damn. All right. Well, that was Sailor Moon S. <laughs> That's right. I think I think we have we have established in canon that in fact Uranus is the strongest. She won yeah, the seems, Sailor Senshi tournament. It seems pretty conclusive at this point. <laughs> um, Av, thank you so much. It was a joy to play with you always, and I, uh, I I look forward to seeing what kind of miserable shit we end up playing next week. It'll probably be CVS too, whatever. Um, and shout out to every, all the Sailor Moonheads who came out to help us learn how to play this game. It's a super fun time. Um, it is, it is. We would have had plenty of fun fun just muddling around on our own. I remember a thing or two, but. Uh, I love it when people roll up to support their game on stream. It's super cool. So thank you so much to everyone for coming out. We'll run Sailor Moon again one of these days. And uh, if if locals, if we're lucky enough for locals to ever come back, you know, uh, maybe we'll bring along the setup and run some in-person Sailor Moon one of these days. That's right. On the Super Famicom. Pull out a CRT Ooh. and everything. Uh, hey, Ava, I feel, I feel like I should ask you this. Do you have anything to plug these days you want to plug on stream? Um... Just follow Future Club, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to have some... You should watch our streams. I think we're going to have... We're actually going to have something pretty cool tomorrow. So... Ooh. I'm going right. to watch that. Well, you heard it. Soon. Check out the yeah, Future Club. Future Club, the homies. Um, what else? Go get uh, We Know the Devil. And... Oh, yeah. Uh, you can get my game. Mind. Buy all my games, please. Yeah. <laughs> Go buy your games. It's, uh, <laughs> we're, we're, we're running game awards right now. Congratulations, Ava. You just won everything. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Yeah. I think it was very hey, sad that she couldn't play to... you last night, by the way. Uh, yeah, uh, shout out to, uh, thanks to everyone who tried to give me tips to help yeah. me beat Pat. <laughs> <laughs> next time. We'll get him next time. And yeah, hit up the, the Sailor Moon ass Discord at moonlightfight.com. You check that shit out. Uh, that's what's up. All right. We'll be back next week with more awesome fighting games, Guilty Gear, etc. Until then, love your life, be good to one another. Play some motherfucking Sailor Moon, it's a good game. Peace out, y'all. Yeah. Mwah. Good night, everyone.